A pint of lager and a glimpse of outer space, please. Alan Boddington is the landlord of the Poltimore Inn in North Moulton. To get his business through the winter months, he's built an observatory where adults and youngsters alike can grab a drink and look up at the stars. Oh, amazing. Um, I was blown away, to be perfectly honest. The kids loved it. They were so full of enthusiasm and you could see the enjoyment. It's some of the best money I've invested. He's invested in an observatory in the pub garden. Complete with retractable roof, punters can sip their pints in awe at the heavens. But it's not just Alan. Exmoor is full of opportunities to look up at the night sky. Dan James from Exmoor National Park explains why. Exmoor has got some of the darkest skies in the country. Just over 10 years ago in 2011, we were designated the very first dark sky reserve in all of Europe. And that's all about engaging people with the dark skies, keeping them dark as a precious and an increasingly rare resource and helping people to enjoy them. Exmoor Dark Sky Festival begins today. Events include stargazing, workshops and even a poetry competition. Over the years, obviously, we're a populated island and we've been developing and the place has got brighter and brighter. And that's why places like Exmoor are increasingly rare. And even places like Exmoor, as a dark sky reserve, are still under threat. So the more we can turn off the lights, the better. And, you know, it's not about saying no lighting by any means, but it's about saying the right light in the right place at the right time. Jeff Moody, GB News.